Hello guys, welcome back or welcome if this is your first video of my that would you watch. In this video, we're going to talk about my reading month for July. I didn't finish reading many books, but I did read this past month. Yellow Face by R. F. Kwan. I'm a hundred pages in and I'm enjoying this book because it's very different than others. Um, the uh, main character is horrible. Um, I'm oh, hoping for her to like fall, like I'm hoping that she doesn't get away with it. If you don't know what this book is about, this book follows June Hayward or June Song and she, after the death of her friend Athena, she passes one of Athena's manuscripts as her own and becomes, becomes like a big sensation. BTW, um, I forgot to mention that Athena dies and that's why um, June takes her manuscript and she edits it and she passes it as her own. Arif Kwan right now is one of my favorite authors. She wrote the Poppy War trilogy and Babel or Babel. So I'm hoping that this month I will finish Yellow Face. Also read The Cat Who Saved Books, a novel by Sosuke Natsukawa. I'm hoping that I'm saying the name correct. And it was translated by Louis Hill Kawai. Kawai. This book uh, follows a teenager called Rintaro. Um, and he has just lost his grandfather and guardian and he like her grandfather had a bookstore and he's like closing it and a cat arrives and this cat has missions for Rintaro like he can speak and he has missions to for Rintaro to help him save books. I'm about a hundred pages in. I like the message of the love of reading, but also to have a life outside reading. Again, I'm hoping to finish this one this month. Then I am also almost a hundred pages in, about like 80 pages, into Star Wars The High Republic, Into the Dark by Claudia Gray. For what I have read of the High Republic books, this is the second book, like chronological order. This follows a Padawan called Wreath, and he loves um, reading and loves like more leisure like peaceful things and his master transfers to like outside of the non republic and he's like um so like she is going for more like action and even though he's not wanting to move he has to and this story for what I have read goes like at the same time as the first book The Light of the Jedi. I am enjoying this one more than the first one. Now let's talk about the books I finished this past month. First, Jujutsu Kaisen Volume 2 by Gege Akutomi. I did a blog reading this volume and I will link it down below if you want to see it. Overall, I like reading this volume. 
um, the extra information presented here expanded the world and brought me more into it to understanding it um, and it felt like I was another student of Jiu Jitsu High Next we have Senseiya or Caballeros del Zodiaco in Spanish by Masami Kurumawa When I was younger, we didn't have cable TV or anything like that and um, streaming services, they didn't exist. So for entertainment, we used to go in the um, weekends to a video rental, to rent movies, or uh, cartoon movies and stuff. And this is where I met Senseiya. I remember I was attracted to it, like I was interested in it because it looked like Sailor Moon, the drawings. Um, and I loved it. I loved this world and I fell in love with it and I fell in love with Greek mythology because of this. Um, when I found this manga volume and also when I read it, uh, I cried because younger me was so happy so happy to be back in this world I don't know if I will continue reading it but this was so good mm -hmm.